Welcome to this Windows channel and today we're going to talk about the upgrade paths for everybody that will upgrade from Windows 7 and Windows 8 to Windows 10. Official release date was announced today June 1st. It will be July 29th and um, they also released a few notes that are of interest. One is about what version everybody upgrades to. So if you've got Windows 7 first of all you need to have Windows 7 Service Pack 1 installed. It's very important. It won't work if you don't have the Service Pack 1 on Windows 7. From there, if you've got a Windows 7 Starter or a Windows 7 Home Basic, you will upgrade to Windows 10 Home. So the uh, Starter and Home Basic brings you to Home. Um, probably what is the most popular right now, the Windows 7 Home Premium, this one will upgrade you to Windows 10 Home also. So Starter, Home Basic and Home Premium all go to Windows 10 Home. If you've got Windows 7 Professional and Windows 7 Ultimate, you are upgraded automatically to Windows 10 Professional. So Windows 10 Pro. So for the Professional and Ultimate versions, it's Windows 10 Pro. In Windows 8, if you've got Windows 8.1, which doesn't have any official version except Microsoft calls it Microsoft 8.1, uh, Windows 8.1 Core, you are automatically sent to Windows 10 Home. That's probably the majority of all of you out there. And one thing for sure is that Windows 8.1 needs to have Windows 8.1 uh, Update 2. So you need to really have the latest updates for it to work well to go to Windows 10. If you got Windows 8.1 with Bing, which is typically a free version of Windows 8.1 that was given to certain small devices. Uh, I've got a small 8-inch tablet, for example, that has Windows 8.1 with Bing on it. Uh, you will also be upgraded to Windows 10 Home, which is not bad at all since um, you actually never did pay for Windows when you have uh, Windows 8.1 with Bing. And finally, the Windows 8.1 Pro users will be moved to Windows 10 Pro. Exclusion to this is the Windows uh, Enterprise version. If you've got Windows Enterprise, um, you are automatically out of the free updates. So any Windows Enterprise version, Windows 7 Enterprise, Windows 8.1 Enterprise, uh, no free upgrades. And the reason why Enterprise does not have free upgrades is because the Enterprise version is meant for companies. And corporate users and all companies will need to actually buy Windows 8, uh, 10. They are not having any free updates. So companies will continue paying for the upgrades to Windows 10, uh, which is basically the enterprise versions. So uh, that's interesting to see. So, um, you know, this is really the official upgrade pad that everybody will have. So depending on what version you have, you see here what version you'll actually be upgraded to. And uh, as for the details of the upgrade, um, we're not really sure yet of, you know, uh, will there be an, I, I, you know, an image file or something that I think that's really needed because, you know, when you enter your email in that little new uh, Windows logo on the bottom right of Windows 7 and Windows 8, you've got a new, um, you know, reserve your copy of Windows 10. Uh, there's nothing mentioned except for upgrades. So, uh, you know, I hope we have image files so that we can actually upgrade machines from scratch and so on uh, on our computers uh, for sure. So uh, if you enjoy our videos, why not subscribe to our channel? You'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions, anything that um, you're not really sure of and want to know more about, let us know. And by the way, for the one million time for everyone that's asking, it's not free for the first year only. It's free forever if you upgrade free in the first year. So if you upgrade in, you know, like in September, you'll have it free and it's going to stay free. You're going to have it free forever. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy the videos.